Hey losers, welcome back to my channel. I'm Coral. I'm here with the books that I'm planning on reading in Jude. Oh, Jude. Why? Why are you here? So I've got a couple here. I really, um, there's also, well, first let me talk about, uh, an arc that I have that I actually really should have read last month and I forgot that I had it. Uh, but this is Maeve Fly by C.J. Lead. This is like female American Psycho. It's touted as, and I have been hearing good things about it. So I am excited to get to it. I really just need to like today pick that up and start it. Um, so there's that. I'm also planning on reading this month Cannibals by Guy and Smith. I don't know how many of you just like look at book covers. You know, but Guy and Smith has some really fucking good ones. This does not even like compare to my favorite, um, favorite covers on some of his mass market paperbacks, um, especially his UK stuff. His stuff released in the UK, it's great. So this is about these cannibals. It says they're half human creatures hideously mutated after generations of inbreeding. So, you know, we get wrong turn vibes, we get off-season vibes. Uh, yeah, I, I don't know if it's gonna be much different than that, but I'm going to read it. I've never read Smith before. Uh, I've got a, two or three of his books, so I figured I better get on it. Then, okay, so this is really exciting. This is Cruel Summer by Wesley Southard. This is going to be my June pick for a book where like a bunch of us can read it. If you're into it, that's cool. If you're not, that's cool. But I've picked out three books for the summer. Cruel Summer by Wesley Southern, Solstice by Lawrence Allison, and Until Summer Comes Around by Glenn Rolfe. And I'm going to read those over the summer months and then do a separate spoilery discussion at the end of the month or the beginning of the next month. I guess whenever I can get to it so we can discuss together because we've read it together and that's so much fun, right? So the first one up is Cruel Summer and this is, it seems like it's going to be a coming of age story. It's about a mother and a son. Um, the mother has an abusive boyfriend and I think they're on vacation and uh, they, I think, kill him and throw him in the ocean, but like something monstery happens and I don't really know like what that entails, but I am really excited. I hope it's like weird and gruesome. That's all I'm asking. Next is a book I am really excited to pick up. This is A Simple Plan by Scott Smith. You might recognize that name. He also wrote The Ruins, and I think these are the only two books he's written. I hear that this one is more of a thriller, which makes sense. Uh, the plot is about a group of men. I think they're hunting and they found, they find like a downed plane, like a little, a little plane, um, a private plane, you know? And under one of the seats, they find a bag full of cash and uh, they decide to keep it, keep the money, keep it to themselves, but things don't work out as they plan in some way. I don't really know, but I am really excited about this. Ooh, I'm excited. I I hear that this is like really good too, like really good. And I also really love the runes, which is why I picked this up in the first place, you know? So I'm hoping that this lives up to my high expectations. I feel like it will, but we'll see. Then I've also decided to finally pick up, this is a book I've had for a while, uh, The Last Days of Jack Sparks by Jason Arnop. I've read one of his books. I read Ghoster a few years ago when it came out and it didn't quite live up to uh, my high regards. But this is more of a found footage type story. Uh, it centers around Jack Sparks who, he does some like journalist ghosty stuff, right? And he's kind of an asshole, like he's known for being an asshole. Um, and this footage turns up of like his last moments, I think, and he's dead, right? And we know he's dead and we're going through the last days of his life and like, how is he dead? Why is he dead? And like notoriously, they talk, like this talks about how, or when people talk about this, they talk about how Jack Sparks is like just a fucking asshole, right? And he's not a likable character. And I'm like, hmm, I like that. 
So uh, I'm, I'm excited to get to this too, finally. Okay, and the last book I'm gonna talk about today is the most recent secret project book that Brandon Sanderson put out. So if uh, for some reason you're watching this and you're awaiting your package or you don't wanna know about it because I think, I don't know, I got my package like a couple days ago, really. So um, yeah. If you don't want to know, skip forward to the end of this video because I'm going to be holding this book up and talking about it. And I know for me, I purposely avoided all the spoilers until I opened the box, so I understand if you're just gonna skip. Okay, do that now because I'm about to hold this book up. So this is the Frugal Wizard's Handbook for Surviving Middle Medieval England by Brandon Sanderson. And this seems like it's gonna be like a little more whimsical, kind of like Tress of the Emerald Sea was. The back says, we here at Frugal Wizard Inc. are committed to providing you with the highest quality experience possible, available to any true wizard for a reasonable price. We provide the fun, you provide the body. And then um, it has a little asterisk and it said, and the money, don't forget the money. Also, we mean your own body, though we don't ask too many questions. So, you know, that leads me to believe it's gonna, gonna be kinda like quippy and funny and snarky and uh, that's all I know about it. So I will be vlogging this again. Um, I will also have my trust vlog up at some point, probably not before this video because it is a very, very end of May when, as I'm filming this and I don't think I'll have the time between all the other things that I really have been putting off editing. I just have not had a lot of time to do that. But anyway, so uh, those are the books that I'm reading this month. I'd love to know if you've read any of these, particularly A Simple Plan and Jack Sparks. Um, let me know if you're going to read Cruel Summer with me. I'd love to have you join in, whether it's audiobook, ebook, physical copy, like something maybe from your library. I'd, although I know those indie books are harder to find, but let me know. I'd love to have you join. Um, like I said, I will be posting the discussion of that either at the end of June or the very beginning of July depending on when I get that filmed. Uh, probably more like the beginning of July, just so like everyone has a chance to finish it. So look out for that too. Otherwise, I will see you guys later. Thank you so much for watching. Goodbye.